Kane Vision welcomes Ryan Wills, who is the head volleyball coach at the University of Tulsa. Man, you guys have been on a run. You're 11 and 1. You just finished off your own tournament at home with three victories. How did you play over the weekend? Uh, we uh, we did some good things. We also struggled a little bit. So, uh, you know, I was proud of the way that you know sometimes volleyball is not about playing your best volleyball every every set, every point. It's about being able to find ways when you are struggling to still come out on top and regroup. And uh, I thought we did a good job of that at times this weekend. And so. Uh, we found a way, and that's important. Yeah, three one wins in all three of your matches, and and I guess sometimes as a as a coach, you want to chew on the one the one set that you lost in each of those, right? Some. Yeah, we uh, it, we were pretty consistent this weekend, and uh, we we won the first two sets, and then we dropped the third, and uh, then we came back and won the fourth. So maybe I just need to not talk at halftime. I don't know, but uh, <laughs> you know, we we relaxed a little bit, and uh, we talked about that this week about how we got to keep pushing, and that's part of. Uh, you know, maturing as a competitor. And so now we turn the attention to American Athletic Conference play and you host Cincinnati on Thursday. Mm -hmm. Now Cincinnati has had a tough schedule, but they're the favorites coming in, right? Yeah, they were picked to win the, the league this year and they're a talented group. I think uh, they pose a lot of uh, problems for other teams with, with what they can do offensively. They have a lot of people that can attack and they push the tempo at times. And so uh, they cause problems for teams. They have played a really tough schedule and they've been challenged. So, you know, with that, there's not going to be anything that we do that uh, will necessarily surprise them and that they haven't seen before because they played some really good competition. So um, they're also probably uh, looking forward to a chance to start conference play and start fresh as well. And so uh, it's definitely going to be a challenge. They're a great team. and. Uh, we're excited about the opportunity. Yeah, 7 o'clock on Thursday at the Reynolds Center, and then noon on Saturday at the Reynolds Center against East Carolina. So mm -hmm. you really love to get off to a good start, obviously, and uh, with some home matches here early in league play, right? Yeah, it'd be huge. And we've obviously we've had a great preseason, and we want to kind of keep that momentum rolling. And uh, got a lot of things we got to keep getting better at, but uh, it is. It's a huge opportunity to get things started, and uh, conference play always uh, seems to focus you a little bit more. And uh, you get to play teams that you know a little bit more, and it's uh, it's an exciting time of the year. One exciting thing for your team is number one in the nation in digs per set. Mm -hmm. What does that say to you? Well, uh, it tells us a couple things. A, that we're playing hard, because uh, a lot of times defense is a little bit of a mentality thing. Um, we obviously have some skill in that position. We have multiple people that can uh, do a good job there, but it shows that we're playing hard. And uh, you know, to be number one in digs per set, that's not an easy thing to do. Um, and excited about that. And so our, our defense is definitely the staple of this team, and we're excited to keep pushing every other part of our program so that uh, maybe it catches up with our defense a little bit. Well, Coach, good luck this week. Thank you. So there you have it, Thursday at home, 7 o'clock against Cincinnati, noon on Saturday at home against East Carolina right here at the Reynolds Center. That is our report on TU Volleyball.